This certainly is not what you'd expect to see in a college library in the middle of finals week. I like keeping my hands busy. It helps me, it helps me concentrate. At a corner table, students and faculty are taking time to knit. It's relaxing and it kind of helps to relieve the stress of finals and everything. Student Catherine Gigi says it helps. When I went back to my books, I was more focused. But librarian Madrika Beauchamp says the knitting is about more than helping students focus. So we figured, why not just go all the way and try and break a world record? The library is hoping to knit the world's longest scarf, and they're going to need a lot more yarn to do it. The current world record is 33.74 miles long, but I'm pretty sure we can beat that. How long until it becomes the longest? Well, it should be original in three years, so. <laughs> but for Catherine, instead of looking ahead to when the scarf is finished, she's taking a trip down memory lane. Having done this in years, I am enjoying myself. Like, it's taking me like way, way back. Catherine learned how to knit from her mother while living in Kenya. We don't have many toys there, so there was something like we did for like extra. Others, like librarian Camille Chesley, <laughs> yeah, learned I mean, how to knit from friends. It's a really big hobby in library school. <laughs> which I guess is a little bit of a stereotype, librarian knitters. So how easy is it to learn? Monday was actually my first day picking up knitting needles, and I learned in about 30 to 45 minutes, so it's actually pretty easy. So maybe this is something that I won't totally screw up. So I decided to give it the old college try. Then you slide the stitch up and onto this needle. So how do I do that part? <laughs> it didn't go so well. So then yeah, I go, go behind. behind there. Oh. Nope. Nope. <laughs> Almost. You're, going, you're trying to do a pearl <laughs> stitch. You're, um, I, I, I thought this behind. was the advanced class. <laughs> Clearly, knitting wasn't for me. What do I do with this part? Mm -hmm. Is oh. that where it needs to be? <laughs> <laughs> oh, nope. Although I struggled to learn how to knit, that hasn't stopped others from picking up needles and yarn. In recent years, knitting has become a much more popular hobby. Even a lot of celebrities have admitted that they like spending a lot of time with yarn. Julia Roberts, Mad Men star Christina Hendricks, even Ryan Gosling has admitted that his perfect day would be knitting a scarf. A lot of my uh, male friends knit, which, um, you know, the stereotype is that it's you know, something that only we, that only women do, but that's absolutely not true. As for breaking the world record, the library faculty already know what they're going to do with a scarf that will be almost 34 miles long. We're actually going to break the scarf up into mini scarves, and we're going to donate to Shelby Emergency Assistance, and they're going to pass it out to families in need who need warm clothing. So come sit and knit and stitch yourself into the record books. Reporting for Falcon Weekly, well, we need some more knitters to come out. I'm Bruce Finkley.